Hi guys! Welcome back sa aking channel and today ay pag-uusapan natin ang MIDI keyboard controller uh, particularly ang Worldy Panda Mini 25 Keys um, keyboard controller But Before that, ano nga ba ang MIDI? MIDI stands for Musical Instrument Digital Interface It sends or transmits a message to your laptop or computer using your DAW and it turns the message into a digital sound or music and this is a very useful and powerful tool um, for musicians and artists like mga um, singer songwriters and by the way um, this is the cheapest um, keyboard controller in the market so nabili ko siya sa Shopee I put the link sa description below, so pakit check na lang po. A Panda Mini controller has a keyboard with 25 keys, 8 drum pads, 4 knobs, 4 sliders, and function buttons. Before tayo pumunta sa setup, I'll show you sample tracks na nagawa ko using the MIDI controller in GarageBand. So, here it is. By the way guys, hindi po siya tutunog kung hindi po siya nakakabit sa um, laptop or computer. So, um, mayroon po siyang kasaling USB cable. So, need lang po natin i-connect ang cable to your laptop. Then, mayroon po siyang system requirements. So, sa flash ko po sa screen. So, pwede siya sa Mac or Windows. So, once kinonect mo yung ano, um, USB, so, mag ilaw siya um, indicating na um, working yung device and ready to work with our um, laptop. Once connected ng ating MIDI controller, just open up a browser and go to en.worldy.com.cn to download the MIDI software editor. Maraming products ang Worldy, so we need to look for the Panda Mini um, for either Mac or PC. So right now we're using a MacBook Pro. So we need to look for the Panda Mini software editor for Mac. Click the download button sa right side and wait for it to download. So na download na natin siya before. So, after downloading it, um, open mo sa file, uh, sa downloads, then um, look for the software editor ng Panda Mini. And it will bring up a virtual keyboard where you can customize um, your setup. You can actually bank up to 4 scenes. So, depende sa yo. Um, you can customize the the drum pads, um, the keyboard, the knobs, and sliders. But if you'd like to stick with the default settings, then you can just leave the way it is. Okay, and after that, um, pwede na tayong pumunta sa ating DAW. So we're using GarageBand. Um, open an empty project. And it will give you four options. 
so make sure to choose the software instrument for MIDI and it will bring up a library of instruments so ayan guys ready na ang ating setup so pwede na siyang patunogin so as mentioned um, marami kang pwedeng pagpipilian na um, instruments <coughs> sa library ng iyong do so for example ito organ Then, kung gusto mo siyang maging guitar, so meron din siyang acoustic guitar. Come up to meet you, tell you I'm sorry. Yan. So, yun guys. So, it can do a lot of things. It can produce um, different kinds of sounds using your um, MIDI keyboard controller. Pwede ka rin gumawa ng sarili mong beats or drum sound using the trigger pads or drum pads. Sample recording tayo using the grand piano. Naway may natutunan kayo sa video na ito. At if, kung nagustuhan nyo ang video, please don't forget to leave a like or a thumbs up. And kung hindi pa kayo nakasubscribe sa aking music channel, please do subscribe by clicking the subscribe button and hitting the notification bell as well para magiging updated kayo sa aking mga upcoming uploads um, in the future. And thank you so much for watching. See you!